I'm still sick. <coughs> you can see my super ghetto setup right in this mirror. Yeah, y'all are sitting on top of a bunch of towels right now because my tripod is literally the size this big. So you gotta make do with what you have. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do my hair in like every video. This is basically how I wear my hair all the time. Sometimes I straighten it, but this is just easier for me because of the way that my hair already is, so. So this is what my hair looks like with nothing in it. I washed it last night and then I did not brush it after and I slept on it and it did this weird thing. Sometimes it's a ton curlier when I let it air dry and I don't sleep on it and like smush half my head. Then it gets like super curly like I have some pieces back here that will demonstrate what my whole head looks like. Yeah, my whole head will look like something along these lines. But my hair is really straight and ratchet and ratty looking in the front. So I have to use a curling wand most days. This is the curling wand that I use. Um, it is a nano titanium. That's all I know. I'm pretty sure it was 20 bucks at Target, so. Push in for turbo heat. Okay. So I let this baby heat up. Right now it's piping hot. I turned the nozzle all the way up to 50. I have no idea what that stands for, but it's hot. So here's what I do to curl my hair. Split it down the middle, and then I take one side and I put it in a hair tie. So I'm like looking like a little girl in pigtails, but only one. So then what I do is I take my hair and I start from the back. So I pull out some pieces and I look at them and I'm like, is this curly enough? So I judge each piece of hair individually. And then I'm like, no. So I take my curling wand and I hold it upside down over my head for this side of my hair. And I either wrap it going this way. So I'll do that. I just wrap it around, hold on there for like 10 seconds. And then it looks all curly and I throw it behind my head. So now I have a single curl looking like a rat tail. I take like this piece, the size this big. And I wrap it, I went this way the last time so I go this way this time. You can just keep alternating, switch it up. You don't have to like switch every time, but just make sure it's not the same. I'm gonna just curl the end of this and throw it back. You know, you guys get it. You understand. Um, when I'm not talking and demonstrating, this takes me a solid 10 minutes, especially if my hair's extra curly that day. So yeah, I'll curl, 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 curl it. Make sure that the pieces of hair that you take out aren't too big or too small. <sighs> so just set your this half of your hair behind your head and let it cool completely. I don't spray my hair with hairspray because not a fan of the crunchy hair type of thing that happens. So now I do my other side. This piece seems curly enough. So when I'm doing this side, I obviously um, still use my right hand and there's no reason for me to go over my head. So I just hold it upside down and I wrap it. I also have to like tuck my other hair underneath my chin. It's really cute. I look super cute when I'm doing my hair. Who wouldn't want to date this? Like, I literally look like a hunchback, but the things you gotta do for beauty. Oh, we got a curly piece. Bye. Now, if you have straight hair naturally or thin hair that doesn't hold curl well, just use some hairspray or thin pieces of hair. Oh, it's a very simple routine for my hair. Ew. Sometimes stuff like this happens and doesn't look cute, so just redo it. <laughs> So now that you look like Shirley Temple, I guess you could leave it like this. A little too curly to me. Here are what my hair looks like from the back. It's all curly and stuff. So the next crucial part is to literally just take your fingers and run it through your hair. The bottom comes out easier, so try to stay away from that. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> but yeah, this is like the finished result. Don't brush it out too much because as you go on through your day, it will come out more. You can also add any serums you want. And I guess you could hairspray it if you want. I just don't want. Here's the finished result. Mm. 
true. And this video was requested by one of my subscribers. So if you guys want to leave any other suggestions below, definitely do that. I want to do what you guys want me to. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Check out some of my other videos if you haven't already. They're more entertaining than this. I'd say this is probably my least entertaining video. More tutorial than anything, but yeah. Like and subscribe. Also check out my social media if you haven't already. Um, here's my Instagram. And here's my Twitter. And here's my Snapchat. I don't know why I'm talking like that. Ew. Okay.